Well, as we mentioned earlier, Madison will soon be at the forefront of the effort to find a COVID-19 vaccine. The UW School of Medicine and, and uh, of UW School of Medicine and Public Health and UW Health was selected to participate in a study to test AstraZeneca's new candidate for a coronavirus vaccine. Dr. William Hartman is an assistant professor of anesthesiology at the UW School of Medicine. Dr. Hartman, welcome to Live at Thanks Four. Thanks for being with Good us. Good to see you. Thank you for having me. So this is very exciting news. Uh, is this as a big a deal as it sounds for Madison and for UW Health? It is. Uh, this is a historical trial. Um, very few times in history as a pandemic like this hit the world. And this is an opportunity for us at UW and for the Madison community at large to uh, show their generosity, to step up to the plate and to do our part to try to get back to a normal life. And part of that is, is finding a vaccine that works. Uh, this is the AstraZeneca vaccine that we think has a good chance of uh, being effective. We know that it's safe. Uh, <clears throat> hopefully by uh, testing it uh, and doing the trial the right way, uh, which, which we intend to do, uh, this will be an effective treatment and a big step getting us back to a normal life. What kind of commitment are we talking about if someone wants to take part in this? So it's a two injection study. Uh, a participant will get an injection on day one and then on day 29, so four weeks apart. We'll be following them in that four week period to uh, make sure that they're not developing any symptoms of COVID-19. Um, and then once uh, they get that second injection, we follow them for two years. And in that two year period, we look for any negative reactions that, that may arise, any development of COVID disease. Um, hopefully, uh, we also get some understanding and some clues as to how long the antibody can stay in your system. How many volunteers are you looking for? And what are the requirements if people who are watching tonight are interested in participating in this? Sure, so uh, as part of the, the larger uh, national effort to get 30,000 participants, we're looking to enroll at least 1,600 participants, uh, up to 2,000, so about 50 participants a day uh, for the next eight weeks. Uh, enrollment uh, really is de dependent uh, just on uh, your desire to, to want to participate and to be over 18 years old. Uh, as long as you don't have any serious uh, health uh, issues that, that are ongoing or, or receiving uh, some medicines that modulate your immune system, you'll qualify for this study. And how do you qualify? How do you sign up? So there's a, a website uh, and then we also have a, a phone number here at UW Health and an email uh, to get your information available, available to us. Our coordinators will contact you do the pre-screening and schedule schedule you to come in. This is an, a double blind placebo clinical trial. What can you explain what that means? Sure. So the, the double blind means uh, I don't know if the patient is going to get the vaccine or a placebo and neither does the person uh, receiving the injection. And so uh, neither of us uh, know what's going on. So we assume that uh, that everyone gets the vaccine, and then we can evaluate the effects. The company will know who gets the placebo versus who gets the vaccine, and be able to determine if we see decreased COVID-19 infections in uh, the vaccinated patients. If so, we feel very comfortable because of the way of this is designed, saying that the reason there is decreased COVID-19 is because of this vaccine. Very exciting news, that's for sure. Yeah. Dr. Hartman, thanks for being with us today. We'll keep an eye on this in the coming weeks. Yes, Thank you. Very much. We'll look forward to having you back, hopefully very soon. Thank you so much for your time.